feel like she own it. Looking like the world is your runway. She can set it off like a gunplay. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you guys have been doing wonderful wherever you are. It is currently 9.35 a.m. here in New Jersey. And it is so cold out here. It's chilly. There's some kind of sunshine, a little bit, you know, of sunshine trying to lie to us, trying to cheat us to go out with, without our jackets. But it, it is cold. Today is on Friday. And uh, which day? I don't know even, I don't know which day today is. And I'm out here sitting uh, in my car waiting for my husband to be done from his doctor. He had a doctor's appointment today and I'm out here waiting for him. And as you can tell, <laughs> I had a cold. Like when we got from Dallas, when I got home, my kids were already when I came from Dallas, my kids were already coughing. They had like a cold, they were sneezing, they had runny noses, which turned into colds. And then it got to me, but mine was a flu, I guess, because th this wasn't a cold. And then I had like uh, my lip breaking, my nose over here breaking. I still have some scabs, but uh, it's healed. Thank thankfully, it was so swollen. This side of my lip was like, oh, so swollen. It's been a week since we got off, since we came from Dallas and it's been more than a week actually. It's been more than a week. And I've just I've just been trying to catch you know to get myself together. This it's been a long, you know, it's been a lot going on like uh, I don't know where to even begin, but I'm going to I'll let you know what's going on real soon. And who guys so today, like I said, today is on Friday, and uh, Lisa has uh, Lisa has a date. Uh, she has a party. Her one of her best friends uh, from school has a party today, and uh, that's why I actually came with my husband. Otherwise, I would I would have been in bed studying because from here we are going uh, probably maybe to Walmart. Should we go to Walmart? I guess or Target. Oh, the mall maybe maybe we might go to the mall we might go to the mall and go pick a gift for her friend she was like oh please please because they gave her the invitation letter yesterday and uh, they, it's gonna be like a slumber party and um, they have uh, it's gonna be a pool party and then they're gonna sleep over there so the mom I've actually been texting with her and I need to respond to her, but I'm using my phone to, you know, to talk to you guys. Uh, they only invited 10 kids. And only four are going to stay. And um, <laughs> Lisa is Lisa is uh, one of the best friends, like the best friend. Actually, the mom was texting me and telling me, oh my God, finally, we get to exchange numbers. Because my daughter has never stopped talking about your daughter like they are bffs and i'm like oh my god me too they're always like uh, you know i don't know these kids and bella too has her best friend they're always chatting like the video call each other every day it's amazing how these things you know this generation is operating because during my time those things are not non-existent so uh, we ended up going to burlington and I was able to grab some stuff for for the kids. I'll show you when I get I, when I get back. I already packed them. I put them in the wrap wrapper thing. You know the the birthday bag. And um, when I come back, am I going this way? Yes, I'm going this way. When I get back, I'll show you. So another thing is, oh my goodness, some people are really nice. So the mom of the birthday girl sent me remember i told you we were chatting in the morning she was like um i i sent her a text i asked her could bella join uh the girls she was unfortunately uh, yes she can but she cannot sleep over because we had already booked um i'd already booked a room for the girls and uh, much as we invited uh 10 uh, 10 friends my my daughter invited 10 friends uh, it's only your daughter and a few other three people, uh, three other kids, 
are going to sleep over so and she also told me one of the moms because she was like oh my goodness i wish i had your number before we would have i would have you know you would have come over you know sleep over and um because the first time she sent me a text i sent her a text at first and then oh my goodness you know how kids can make you have friends now i feel like now i'm, I'm a friend to this uh to these parents so i sent her texts in the morning because lisa gave me that the invitation letter at night so i sent her text it was like um i got i got the eva may i got your babies i got your babies a invitation inviting my baby so it's okay she can come she was like oh my goodness i'm so glad i have your number i have your contacts like you know <laughs> it felt so nice it felt nice like you know when parents interact because you know like your kids they make you do things that you never imagined you would do or they make you meet people that you never imagined you would meet so that's a good thing she was excited and even bella's i think um before we went to dallas the week where the week where we went to dallas was that the same week i believe she was supposed to go for a sleepover to her friends so they normally facetime each other every evening they have a tablet so they always like facetime each other so every day every day they are talking talking i'm like oh my goodness you guys like you're spending too much on those things no i'm talking to my friend so the other girl the other baby <laughs> the other girl made her mother talk to bella and ask bella because i had i had i had them talk like oh is your mom there yeah she's here my mom is also here you know let's make them talk so the other mom was on the on the on the video she was like oh hi um these girls oh my goodness they have been uh my daughter has been on my neck about you yeah, about bella bella every day every day every day i want to go to bella's house i want to go to bella's house and i'm like oh my gosh bella too she's like i want to go to my friend's house i want to go to my friend's house all that time so we were laughing and the other kid <laughs> was at the back of her, of her mom jumping mom 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 her, did you ask her did you ask her can we can i go there oh can she come please 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 she was she was doing that and bella was also doing the same thing i'm like oh my goodness yes i've heard you we're gonna yes we're gonna we're gonna organize so they were supposed to go on uh bella was supposed to have a sleepover and um but we had to travel no we went shopping did we go for shopping? I think we traveled. Or maybe we went for shopping. Something like that. We went for shop. We, I think we went to shop for the trip. So, the, she ended up not going. But they still talk. And, um, did we, I think we got them presents from Dallas. She was like, um, when we went to buy some stuff, she was like, I must get something for my friend. And... <laughs> My goodness i remember even my our youngest son also had a friend and they had a sleepover guys i am telling you as a parent you really have to be careful with these things because some families you know we have families who come you know like from different dynamics uh, different setups so for me at first i was like mm. but again today this is they're going they're going to a hotel they'll be sleeping at the hotel so that's a that's a plus and the mom was like she's gonna be sleeping with one of the one of the moms is gonna be sleeping like us you know adjust adjacent rooms they're gonna stay with the kids with the girls until very late i don't know where i'm going they're gonna stay with the kids until like super late uh she, she's gonna order some food and uh I, also, I feel bad because you know uh, they told me earlier would have really prepared it's three half 30 more minutes go pick up these people that is close that's a big car okay i have to park here we're just picking the kids stuff parking only yes but i gotta park here So it 
was amazing. It's amazing how these kids can make you, you know, can make you have make friends without even you trying. Or maybe you've messed with this the, the same person, you know, somewhere in the store, at a church, at school. Here, parents we meet, we don't say we, use, we even don't say hi to each other. You just like, especially this cold season, you're just like you stay in your car until when it's like two minutes to them opening the. The doors, you're like, oh, okay, bye, see ya. You know, you don't say, we don't say hi, but the kids, they're very pure. They're very innocent. Oh my God, did you guys see, there's a video online, circulating online. This is a Kenyan girl. I think she was in the middle, she was in the middle East. She was working there as a house help. She was a nanny, I believe. And they were, she was finally going, uh, going back to Kenya. I believe the other day she was going back to Kenya to see she also has kids she was going to see her family and um, the other family had to see her off and um, the kids they had like four is it four or five kids very young kids I believe one was maybe one or two years oh my god these kids were wailing at the airport they were crying clinging onto the onto the onto the girl the nanny the girl was also crying she they were crying so bad chesting they didn't want the parents they were like they want their nanny and she you know she had like um the family i feel like the family was really good because the the father the, the husband and the wife were all there to see her off and they were pushing her bags you know like in that big cart she had like really big suitcases and the husband was pushing the suitcases she was because she was also crying the nanny oh my goodness the nanny was also crying so the babies are crying they're running you know how the airports are big the babies are running i'm gonna if i find that clip i'm gonna include it here i'm gonna i'm gonna include it here they were running chasing after her it was so heart-wrenching it was so touching because again these are babies they are like so pure to like for if you see a child running away from somebody that's a bad person like you should be very worried but these babies they were like crying and then i i uh, believe when she arrived in kenya they were facetiming they were talking to each other it was really nice and that clip it got million i believe if it's not millions but millions or maybe a hundred almost a million views and that is just like facebook because i i feel like it was on tiktok it was on tiktok i didn't check the tiktok but somebody took it from tiktok and put it on facebook or maybe in, i saw it on in, instagram and my husband sent it to me on facebook you know like the link uh, it was like okay this thing is going viral so i'm telling you some the, we have really really nice people out there because We've heard of horrible, horrible, horrible stories of um, so many stories. Like actually, maybe let's say like 80% or if not 90% of people who go to work in the Middle East from Africa, from Kenya, Tanzania, uh, Uganda, Rwanda, these countries, they go through a lot in the Middle East. Like people have lost their lives. They kill them. And they kill them they bury them in the you know in in the forest like in the desert and your loved one is gone and you will never hear from them like really really bad stories i'm telling you guys if you're not from the third world country when you see us here we are coming from it's not like our countries are like really 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 bad that we don't have wars you know like such kind of stuff it's just like we are so unfortunate i feel like the leadership over there is not been has not been like really you know favoring um it's it's people because i feel like africa is a very rich a very rich continent it's just like we don't have you know good leader, leaders you know to take us to the next level you know it's just selfish uh selfish leaders corruption and just if you find somebody nice somebody good somebody genuine who who like raises will you know a, who blows a whistle like why is this why is this thing happening like right now my country is a mess it's a mess it's not like we are fighting or anything but it's a mess over there it's, corruption is on the roof like life is so freaking hard it's just a mess okay and i feel like everywhere in the world right now is it these are these are the end times i'm telling you anyway enough of rambling let me just chill here and uh 
you know wait for the time and then talk to you soon the birthday girl i got her this blanket which has an eye mask what is this it has socks it has a blanket it has a journal and a palm pen and eye mask and um I also got uh, this nice cozy house shoes and also got a, a pajama which I liked this is for ages what between 10 and 12 and a card that they are going to write on and uh, a headband a spa head wrap and also because i knew the other girls the other kids over there i they're gonna share this i got the lip glosses each each kid is gonna have one but her she might take she will take two because there are 12 in here i also got them um these hair things hair bands for each kid will take one so these are five one these are five and these are five two and this one came off actually one came off and also these ones so yeah and uh, also for lisa i she also got this one and uh oh, oh i put some socks in on there in inside uh, these are the other kids I got the same socks as Lisa and uh, this is Lisa I got them different just in case they confuse them and also this is Lisa so that they can match with a BFF and this is for Bella even though Bella is not going to sleep there but I also got Bella this and a matching pajama and that's it so we're almost there it's two minutes to the hotel and we made it safely the girls are behind there they are so excited lisa is here and so bella sweet. and it's my sweet over by the way well, it's not mine, it's <laughs> yeah so i'll let you know we're here let's go let's go <laughs> and these ones are so excited Okay, we are lost. We came to the wrong Hayat. So, but the other one is 0 0.9 miles from here, like four miles, four minutes from here. So, uh, we are not very far from where they are. Oopsie. Let me tell you, I was getting so irritated. What? I was getting so irritated. I was almost driving home until I saw this. Ooh, okay. Nice. Yep. I was telling Crystal the last time I was here was my high school prom. It was here. Seriously? Yeah. So it seems like they're having something going on again. But like last time that I was here, we had a. Patty is done. Patty is over with us. I'm here with my munchkin. She's upset. She's not happy. Her sister stayed. They had a lot of fun. They went to the pool. Like they were super duper excited. They were happy. And uh, I gotta go. We got me. I have to go home and chill a little bit before I go to work because it's a quarter past eight so yeah that's it so so lisa and a few other people are going a few other kids and uh, two other parents are going to stay over and uh, i almost called out it was so good and uh, they had the for the adults they had a bunch of cocktails um some margaritas here and there and um, to be honest i'm a little bit tipsy but we gotta get home and my baby here he's hungry 
She's so hungry. And <laughs> she's not happy. She's upset. I'm trying to make her smile. That's why she's at the front. Please, you okay? Are you okay? Please, you forgive me. You, 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 your sleepover is gonna be fun, okay? I'm gonna make sure. You can call. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure that we invite your friend. Don't do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure that we call your friends over for a sleepover or something. No, this time round I won't say, okay? I promise, okay? Anywho, guys, I'm gonna, we're gonna go drive and we're gonna go figure out where we're gonna eat or pick something along the way before we get home. We eat, we chill, and <laughs> I gotta go to work. I tried to call out, but I couldn't. Like, I don't, I've called out so much because, because of the trip that I went to Texas, so I called out a lot. Because those were like five, I took off like six days. So like I exhausted everything. I can't, I can't, I can't. Like my husband was like, you need to call out. Like you can't. I wish I could, but I can't. And Hey guys. It is the following day after dropping Lisa off at her friend's birthday party at Hyatt Regency. And uh, I just woke up. Uh, we are on our... We, we are on our way. We are going to pick her up. Pick up was 10 previously, but uh, the mom of the other girls uh, was like, could you make it at least by 1? Because the girls want to go to the pool. And it's 15 minutes to 1, and we are still here. Bella slept here. She, she didn't sleep there because they didn't have enough space. So she wanted to go there earlier and spend time with them, but I was so tired. I worked last night. I literally just woke up. And so she's been ready since morning. And I slept off. She took my phone. She had been texting the mom, can I come please? So the mom was like, please let Bella come. But I was asleep. <laughs> I feel so bad for her, so we want to go to the mall, you know, uh, she likes going to the mall and maybe buy her one or two things to make her feel better because I feel bad for the, for my girl. So, the kids got this and uh, we're going to go to Macy's just to look around and see what they have. Yes, I know Every day, honey, they're, they're worth it. I love them. So I just apply the color. I look a mess, a mess, a mess, a mess. Oh my god. I just washed off that color so fast because my appointment is in the next um, my last appointment is at 2 p.m. and it's 1:51, but I have like seven minutes a seven minute drive and I'm gonna have I should be there at 1:58. Yeah, I had to wash off that color because I didn't want to come here uh, with color, you know, dripping. And as such, the color, I didn't give the color like enough time for it to like really get to where I wanted. But from here and the remnants, oh my gosh, I'm crazy. The remnants, I was like, you know what? Because if you leave color, it's gonna like boil. It's not good to leave. If you once you open and mix it just use all of it or so just toss the remnants so the remnants I was like you know what let me just like toss it you know try to color one of my wigs which I rarely wear and um, I finished it and now I regret because I have now to go back to the hair you know store and get the same color can put it back because it, it's right now it's giving Auburn is giving like the four colors the four colors like I, I don't know the the leaves It's giving like the leaves is giving like orangish reddish around there so But then my hair was so dark 
that should have been expected but from here i'm going to get another color the same color and color my hair again because i want that nice bright red nice mercedes okay sis so we are turning left Here we in go. 600 feet, your destination will be on the left. Oh, shoot. Where am I gonna park? Okay, guys, I'm gonna put you down because I don't know where I am. And the lashes. Mm. I love them. They're so full. It's gonna take a while for them before like they fall off, which is what we're looking for. And I loved her. You know, there are those texts like they're really rough with you. Oh my gosh, she was so gentle, and I'm gonna keep her. She's so nice. I'm gonna put her in for. Uh, page somewhere here go definitely if you're in the massa area princeton uh, hamilton i don't know uh morrisville in pa like close by come check us so as a very nice uh girl like i really like her work i really do so go follow her page on instagram and uh, you know support a uh, black girl okay black girl business all right let me rush because my kids are already home i'll talk to you soon <laughs>